I welcome you to today's spiritual breakfast. I bring greetings to you. Hello everyone, praise the Lord. Very good morning and I'm happy that God has brought us together to meditate this for today. Hello everyone, praise the Lord. Good morning. Today is a new day and also we are at the end of the week. God has been so faithful to lead us throughout the week. So give thanks unto him for his faithfulness. And his hand was with us throughout this week. He was with us throughout the first week of this month of March. So give thanks unto him. And today's meditation is from the book of Acts chapter 21 verse 21 they have been informed that you teach all the jews who live among the gentiles to turn away from moses telling them not to circumcise their children or live according to our customs so the problem here is the elders of the church or the elders in jerusalem or informing apostle paul that the Jews over here have heard that it is not what you have said but they have, they have heard that you are against Moses and that is the uh, very thing that is happening even now in our time even now we are listening to the sermons uh, the grace preachers bring on that the law of Moses is here the law of grace is here law of Moses is being demolished by the new laws that Jesus Christ has given so the grace the law of grace is the first one that we will have to follow that is the same thing it was not what apostle paul preached but it was what the jews in jerusalem have heard as apostle paul say so my dear brothers and sisters that is the very thing that is happening it is not what the bible says but these people are creating it i want to warn you that there are chances that you will go across this you will pass through this you will you will go through this moment to hear the heresy like this do not say that oh i have been growing in in, in assemblies of god church i have been growing in a pentecostal church so no, there is no way that i will listen to such preachings let me tell you i see you uh, i see a family who have been part of our church for 26 years who have been listening to the word of god uh, from my dad for 26 years they're standing in that church the the same person who preached that if you come here and make make some four steps it, it has more power than the 40 days of fasting and prayer such foolishness were preached in that church and these people are standing there and dedicating their child oh my goodness yes satan is dedicating your child that is what i will say satan is dedicating your child who 26 years they listen to the word of god sitting in a pentecostal church i want to tell you be careful there are people who will divert you like this you will hear as the word of god said that is why we say that don't watch all this sermons preachings that you hear in 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 in, in the youtube don't say people uh, people say in tv come let's pray we will pray we will we will you have your pastor you have your church you have the programs in your church that is enough for you don't be over spiritual to say that oh i will attend that also i will go there also you will fall i tell you i want to tell you i want to warn you even in this last day be careful about all these things follow what your church is doing just follow what your pastor is doing. Amen.